finding the first terms of a geometric sequence using an explicit rule. Find the first four terms of the sequence given by the following. So I have an explicit formula here. It's telling me that I can find the value of any term number in my sequence by starting with 6 and then multiplying by negative 4 as many times as I need to. <clears throat> now, since I don't have to multiply by negative 4 to get the first term, the first term is 6, I'm going to always be multiplying it one time less than the term number I'm looking for. Now, I could substitute in 1, 2, 3, and 4 up here for n and then evaluate, but really the easiest way to get this done is just to look at the information that's in the formula itself for me. So the general form, or the general explicit form for a geometric sequence is a sub n equals a sub 1 times r to the n minus 1. So if we compare this to the actual sequence that I have, this number, a sub 1, in my general form, corresponds to the 6. In, my, in this specific equation I'm looking at. So that means the 6 is my a sub 1 or my first term. So I already have the first term of my sequence just by looking at my formula. Now this, the r stands for the common ratio I can see right here. That's the negative 4. That's the pattern or the number that I'm multiplying by to get from one term to the next. So to get from the 6 to each subsequent term, I just need to multiply by negative 4. So 6 times negative 4 would be negative 24 for my second term. And then I need to multiply by negative 4 again to get my third term. Okay, so... Uh, negative 24 times negative 4 gives me positive 96 for my third term. And then multiplying by negative 4 one last time gives me negative 384 for my fourth term. And again, I got this information, my first term value, 6, and what I multiply by every time just by looking at my formula here.